So this is a pool right here. It has uh, like mosquitoes, insects, some little leaves, a plate. And it doesn't have that much dirt no more. But it does have some. Uh, I'm going to show you guys how I clean it. I'm going to brush it. And then that's the uh, vacuum that turns on. I'm going to turn on the filter too so it can start moving and sucking all the dirt from the bottom. And then I'm going to use the net too. Okay, so right now I'm going to clean this. That's a bag that I took out. And then I'm going to clean the filter right now so I can put a clean filter. Okay, I'm going to show you how I do that. Okay, and then here's my pump, and then this is the cartridge holder. I'm going to open this up and take the cartridge out and then put the one that I just cleaned. And then I'm gonna open that up and take off any, take out any leaves and debris that have been collected in there. Here's the dirty one, and it's so heavy, it's so heavy and full of dirt, and leaves, and just bad stuff. And here's the clean one, look at the difference, see that? And now that I cleaned out that thing that you saw me pull out of there with all the leaves and the little sticks and everything, I put it back after I took out the trash and I put a new filter. This one I'm going to go clean it so it can be ready for next time. And I'm going to turn on the pump, but I want to make sure there's enough water like the water level has dropped since it's been hot so I'm gonna turn on the hose so that it's filling up the pool and then I'll turn on the pump in the filter right now okay okay so right now I'm putting more water in the pool I'm going to use the net and take out all the big debris and then I'm gonna brush it and I'm also turning on the pump. And I'm gonna switch this to on. 
and then you hear it go on. Heard that, and now it's gonna start doing some action over here. It's gonna take a while. So let me get the net because I have my net over there, I gotta put it on the pole. That's what I got guys with the net and now I'm going I'm going to brush it and my battery is dying. So I'm going to brush it with the brush and then I'm gonna show you how the vacuum is gonna start sucking everything. So now that this is sucking, I'm gonna go ahead and put the vacuum in there. I already did the brushing, I brushed it because for some reason the vacuum, like it won't go to that far end. So what I do is I sweep with the brush, I just brush everything, all the dirt over to this side. Because eventually it does, but you know, I just want it to, because it'll do this part over and over. Like, it'll vacuum this part over and over, but it doesn't go over there. Like, it discriminates that part of the pool. I don't know why. So, here's the vacuum. And now I'm going to put it in here. Then you hear that noise. You see the hoses are shaking, and the hose head or the vacuum head now is moving on its own. So, pretty much from the pressure of the pump cleaner, it's moving the vacuum head all over the pool, sucking everything from the ground. And I'm filling it up because the water level goes down and then this will make a noise when it doesn't have enough oh and enough water and then I have to get a new skimmer in it and here is uh, the duck this duck is where I put the chlorine tablets um, I, I really didn't have to put shock because the water has been Clean. It like I it didn't turn green, I guess because all winter we had it moving, and we had it moving because we were building this shade here, this patio cover, 
and then we redid this uh, all the concrete so the pool was getting dirty but every time we would do something like after we laid the concrete uh, there was a lot of concrete powder and dirt and rocks on the bottom so I cleaned the pool and then also and then also after we did the patio cover there was a lot of wood so I again I cleaned it I would run the pool pump to clean it yeah guys so um, if you have any questions how to clean uh, your pool uh, let me know maybe I can help you we've lived here for about three years and at the beginning we didn't know how to clean it really good I didn't um, it would turn green because we wouldn't run the pump and it took us a while to get the hang of how to keep it clean uh, and learn how to clean it ourselves but this automatic vacuum it helped a lot because my husband he works he's tired he doesn't want to be out here you know cleaning it and this saves you a lot because it's doing it on its own and yeah um, I haven't put any shock you know I don't like to put a lot of chemicals if we don't need to I'm gonna get more chlorine tablets because I do keep chlorine tablets in that duck that I showed you and I basically just clean it with the net any big things that fly in here and uh, then I brush it uh, all that is like stains that just are in the plaster and we will replaster it but not yet that's just like stains in the plaster I guess it's getting worn out but yeah so I hope this video helps you to give you an idea how I clean my pool. Maybe it'll help you clean your pool. Um, if it was green and I was getting it ready from the winter, you know, I would put a uh, shock and then wait the next day and brush it, do the net and just keep running the pump and then cleaning and changing the filters that's what i would do but like i said uh, that's how it was in the beginning now that we keep it i keep up with it it's easier to keep clean and and i just do it myself save myself that money okay so this is my lime tree and it has a lot of little blossoms coming out all the way to the top up here and it smells so good it smells like lemons well this is not lemon this is limes they're gonna be green let me see if i can zoom in like that little flower the little flower will come off and then it will have, let me see if I can zoom in on one. So the flower falls off, okay? And then where the flower falls off is the little butt of where a lemon will be. So every little flower, every little flower butt is pretty much a line. right here uh, right here this one that's gonna be a line it's tiny itty bitty 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 tiny tiny but I'll record again and I'll show you guys how they're going in size Thanks for watching guys and 
I'll see you next time.